Okay, the first craft we're going to do is the easy spider craft and what you'll need is construction paper, googly eyes, a crayon or marker, glue stick, glue, and scissors. Okay, I'm just going to cut a circle. I just used something we had and drew a circle around it for the body of the spider and cut it out for him and I will let him glue it on the paper when we're ready. I'm also going to be drawing a spider web in the corner here in just a moment. All right, so I drew a web. And we are just we cut a circle, didn't we? We're talking about circles this week. And then what do we need, Boo? I don't know. Um, googly eyes. Googly eyes. Let's do it. All right, and we use the liquid glue here for the googly eyes. I let him help me squeeze it, and we both put it on together, but he really loves doing glue. It's going to be eight. 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 So we're also studying eight. the number eight, aren't we? So we did our circle, and now we're going to do the number eight, which is our eight legs, right? Um, I, I think we need some glue. Yep, let's do it. And I just took the legs and did a fold back and forth to do like an accordion style fold on each of the legs and had him glue them onto the paper. He had a lot of fun with this. Oh my goodness. It's on his head! Okay. Move that one down by his leg. Over here. All right, that is it. I hope you enjoyed this super easy craft. Most of these items you probably have in your closet. Um, even the eyes you could just draw on if you didn't have the googly eyes, but we had a lot of fun I ended up framing it, but taking the glass out so the legs kind of popped out super fun Let's jump right into our DIY Halloween garland What you'll need is construction paper googly eyes cotton balls glue stick and glue scissors tissue squares hole puncher ribbon ghost template which I'll link below and then the pumpkin template which I'll link below Okay, here are the templates. I just cut them out and traced them on some white cardstock paper. You can use any type of thicker paper or construction paper. I have a pumpkin and ghost for each of the kids. And basically, we're going to do googly eyes for the ghosts. And then I cut up some faces for uh, the pumpkin. And that'll go there. And then for the pumpkin, I'm just gonna have them glue on squares all around and then I'll put in the green on the top or maybe I'll have them do it and then for the ghosts I'm going to have them do glue on all these little um, cotton balls so all over and then I'll do a hole punch here and put some ribbon through it and then I will hang it up on our mantle because the kids have been wanting to help decorate so this will be fun. I'm just going to fast forward here and show you kind of the routine we did here to get this project done. Um, most of these items I actually got at the dollar store, especially the tissue papers, the cotton balls, um, even the googly eyes. They didn't have the big ones, but they did have the smaller ones, so you could do that. Um, and that string I also got at the dollar spot. And also that tray, you guys. Um, I used that to put their craft supplies in just to keep it all organized. <music> After you're done, just punch holes in the top and string through on a string and hang up your garland on the mantle. We love this project, you guys. You can do it the night before, you can even do it the day of, and then you can just take it right down. <laughs> but uh, the kids loved it and they were proud to do it. So I hope you enjoyed these crafts. I hope that you try them yourself, at least one of them, and let me know in the comments below if you ended up doing that. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe so that I know that you stopped by. I hope you have a wonderful Halloween. Stay safe and don't eat too much candy.